The personal chef of former U.S. President Barack Obama was found dead. His name was Tafari Campbell. He was 45 years old. Claims suspicious bandages on former President Barack Obama's hand on Friday imply that he was complicit in the death of his personal chef earlier this month. Barack Hussein Obama II, the full name of the 44th president of the U.S., was born in Honolulu, Hawaii on August 4, 1961. He was the first African-American to hold the position. Obama served as the senator for Illinois in the U.S. Senate from 2005 to 2008 before winning the presidency. Since the end of the Reconstruction in 1877, he was only the third African-American to be elected to that legislature. The Nobel Peace Prize was given to him in 2009 for his extraordinary efforts to strengthen international diplomacy and cooperation between peoples. Barack Obama Sr., Obama's father, was a young goat herder in rural Kenya who later received a scholarship to study in the U.S. and rose to the position of senior economist in the Kenyan government. Before moving to Honolulu, Ann Dunham, Obama's mother, lived in Kansas, Texas, Washington State, as a child. She and Barack Sr. married less than a year after they first met in a Russian language lesson at the University of Hawaii in 1960. Barack Sr. moved away when Obama was two years old to pursue his education at Harvard University. Shortly after 1964, Ann and Barack Sr. divorced. Obama only had one more brief encounter with his father when he was 10 years old. Later, Ann remarried, this time to the Indonesian student named Lolo Sotero, who was also a foreigner, and together they had a second child named Maya. APS estimation false. An Obama official claimed that the Democrat was sporting golfer's tape on his left hand, as seen in numerous previous images. The former president is wearing the tape appropriately according to golfing experts, and golfers frequently use it to prevent blisters and split calluses. The reality, images of Obama playing golf on Martha's Vineyard have rekindled rumors that Tafari Campbell was killed by drowning in the waters near the former president's summer residence on the Massachusetts island. The images, which the Daily Mail first released on Friday, show Obama as he hit the course at the Vineyard Golf Club on that particular day while sporting a polo shirt, white shorts, a cap, and sneakers. On his right hand, he's wearing a white glove as well, while his left hand is gloveless, showing two bandaged fingers. One Instagram post that features his photo stated, This is the very first picture taken of Barack Hussein Obama just days after his personal chef, Tafari Campbell, mysteriously died in three feet of water at Obama's home in Martha's Vineyard. He has hands cut like he got into an altercation. A lot weird. The small beige wraps, which were on his middle and ring fingers, aren't suspicious, though. Obama, a devoted golfer, has frequently been pictured over the years with such finger guards while on the course, especially during his family's summer vacation on Martha's Vineyard. A check of the Associated Press online photo collection produced images from August 2015 when the president was golfing at Farm Neck Golf Club in Oak Bluffs while sporting two bandages on his left middle finger. Later that month, he returned to Farm Neck Golf Club and was once more photographed while sporting finger wraps, but this time they were on both his ring and middle fingers. In 2010, he was spotted playing golf at Vineyard Golf Club in Edgar Town while sporting a single bandage on his left middle finger. The bandages are actually golfer's tape, according to Obama's spokeswoman, Eric Schultz, who also stated that using them has been standard practice for him for many years. According to the Brad Woodger, owner of the Royal and Ancient Chakapaki Lynx, a different golf course on Martha's Vineyard, the tape aids golfers in avoiding sore blisters or split calluses. According to him, Obama's wraps are positioned rather conventionally, with one above the knuckle on his middle finger, another below the knuckle, and a third above the knuckle on his ring finger. The friction and movement of the club can cause blisters in certain contact spots on the hand, Woodger stated in an email. Even with a bandage over it, once the blister forms, it makes the swinging motion difficult. Blisters frequently form if a person is playing for extended periods of time or hasn't played in a while, according to Fort Myers, Florida-based PGA certified golf pro Steve Eisenberg, who also serves as the president of Golf Concepts Consulting. Obama is a left-handed golfer, which explains why the former president chose to use tape on that hand while wearing gloves on the right hand which is known as the lead hand, according to the golfer. In an email, Eisenberg stated that feel is ultimately what matters. Wearing gloves helps with grip stability and reduces blisters. A glove on the lead hand and no glove on the other hand strikes a compromise between protection, grip, stability, and the feel of the hand without a glove on the club, but it also diminishes the sensitivity of your hand attached to the club. On July 23rd, Campbell drowned after falling off his paddleboard on Edgartown Great Pond, close to the location of the Obama's waterfront residence. The following day, the body of the 45-year-old former Sue Cook at the White House was found. The death wasn't suspicious, according to the Massachusetts authorities. What do you think about this discussion? Is it suspicious? Come back and have more of this topic.